So just to give you a idea of flow of presentation today, first, we're gonna have our new vice president of truck, Dave Carson, introduce himself and mm -hmm. give us some context uh, to the session and why we're all here today. Then I'll take you through some of our exciting offerings in the heavy truck space at CDK. And then followed by Henry, who is going to give you a sneak peek of everything that's coming. So with that, Dave, you have the floor. Thank you so much. And uh, thank you everybody for joining. It's a pleasure to all meet you all. Uh, so uh, I'll be uh, remotely at this particular point. Um, and uh, thank you uh, as well, Marlene, for finding a picture of me that has some hair. Uh, I you know, I'm a little bit old, but uh, <laughs> I just uh, do appreciate that. Um, first of all, just I want to let everybody, uh, let everybody know how excited I am to be working with the heavy truck dealers. Um, it's not foreign to me to be part of this team. I had some heavy truck experience a few years back, but I've um, I am a 30 year veteran of CDK. I've been in uh, I filled several different roles um, throughout my career, working with the uh, automotive dealers on the region side. Uh, the enterprise accounts, which, which would be like the publicly held dealership groups, uh, OEM relations, as well as, again, heavy trucks. So I'm excited to be back and I'm excited to have today's uh, opportunity to share with you what um, why we, we asked everybody to get together, participate in today's webinar. And then also, uh, um, hopefully in the very near future, I'll be meeting many, many, many of you to learn more about you and what's important to your business. So. Uh, as, if you were in the general session earlier, you heard Brian talk about uh, CDK's overall impact on the economy, and heavy truck is a core part of our business, and it's something that we are moving uh, forward with quickly and making uh, more and more investments in, um, and this makes me very excited to be about a, a part of truck because I know that the, the heavy truck market has been looking for some direction from CDK, and CDK is putting their shoulder against that. Here's what we have underway and what we're going to be talking about um, uh, today, you know, throughout today's webinar. You know, at CDK today in the heavy truck space, we already um, have added new resources to all aspects of our business. Uh, we're working with the OEMs on uh, new integrations and um, we're working on our functionality to help you, the modern heavy truck dealer, sell and service more vehicles. So um, it just really excites me to be part of your market uh, part of the leadership team that's going to, you know, help move things uh, forward. And um, I, you know, I have a couple of key things that I am really focused on as I get uh, going, which I think is part of CDK's overall um, uh, uh, focus on you. And that that is actually just, I, I want to get out in the field and develop relationships with the dealer market. Um, I really want to understand what's important to you and your business. And then I want to help focus CDK to take action. So my three tenants that are to listen, to comprehend, and act. And um, I'm just hopeful that you guys, after today's webinar, see the uh, energy and excitement that's being put into heavy truck as we go through our session. Um, and again, uh, at any time, anybody can reach out to me. I'm excited to get going. And I just want to thank you again. Marlene, I'm going to turn it thank back Thank you. Over. Yep. Thank you, Dave. It's awesome. So as Dave said, um, we ultimately want to help you sell and service more trucks and increase your efficiency. So real quick, how do we do that? First and foremost, our relationships, right? With our OEMs, with our ISVs, but very importantly with you, our, our truck dealers. And as Dave said, you know, we want to listen. We want to hear what you have to say so we can give you the solutions you need when you need them. Um, Dave mentioned new resources. I'm kind of part of that. Um, I've been in the truck space at CDK for about eight months now. I've seen a lot of movement, very exciting to be here. Um, and my part of my role is also to listen to what you have to say. So that feedback that you give your sales associates, keep it coming because it is getting to us. We're trying to find processes to corral that, prioritize it and use it most, most importantly, right? Because you can tell us all kinds of things. At the end of the day, what are we doing with that feedback? And so that's a very important uh, part of my role, Henry's role, Dave's role is to gather that feedback and really use it. So that, that relationship with you is, is very important. Um, another aspect is connecting. Um, you, you heard some of that in the keynote session. So connecting with your OEM, connecting within your dealerships, the divisions within your dealerships, so the right hand knows what the left hand's doing, um, connecting with your customers, and also connecting between your solutions, whether it's a CDK solution, a partner solution, ISV solution, we want to make sure that's a 
integrated experience for you. So that's really important um, what we're working towards to get there. So everything kind of starts with the DMS. I think most of you are familiar with that. So not just the accounting, um, but other operational aspects like service, parts management, um, payroll, the executive desktop, giving you an overview of your business. And Henry, who no doubt is gonna be the star of our show today is going to show us um, some very cool things that are happening with DMS. Sorry to put you on the spot, Henry. Um, but beyond the DMS, we also wanna make sure that if you're not finding what you need within the DMS, that we can pull in other solutions for you to really give you that overview. So let's say you want um, more comprehensive reporting functionality. We can get that for you. Um, you're into truck leasing. We can help you with that. So we really wanna make sure we connect all those dots and that we're what we say, you know, your technology partner for the long haul, that we're there for you with what you need. So some examples of that, you heard it during the keynote too, is the, the OEM integrations. In the heavy truck space, we have over 80 of those. Six of those were launched in the last uh, four months while I've been here. Um, another 15 are in the pipeline. So we're really making great strides to make sure that we, we integrate as well as we can with the OEMs. We have somebody on our team who's awesome at driving those relationships with the OEMs, and she really makes sure that voice is heard. Another exciting development is service view. Um, you heard a little bit during the keynote about how we're changing service in the truck space. We partnered with True Video and that gives this kind of um, solution that allows your technicians, essentially I'm oversimplifying, but record whatever repairs need to be done and then be able to send that video on their mobile phone to, um, to whether it's the driver, the fleet owner, and say, okay, here's the things we're seeing. Do you approve this repair? And we've seen turnaround times as low as 15 minutes between when the truck comes in and we get that approval. So that really gets the trucks on the road faster, gives you potential for higher revenue. And most importantly, that communication with your customer, as you heard in the keynote, just making sure the customer can trust you and can see rather than you saying things that they not really sure, do we need that repair or not? So service you really helps with that. And then the last thing I wanna highlight um, is that we do have a whole team at CDK too that can help you with not just telephony and collaboration, but also cybersecurity. And with the FDC safeguards rule going into effect, I believe December 9th, that's a big thing. That's That applies to, to heavy truck dealers as well. We have an ebook that we will make sure to send you in the follow-up email. Um, that talks about if you haven't wrapped your head around that, that's information for you. And then if you do need help with that, we're, we're happy to do that. So again, some examples of, you know, going beyond the DMS and being able to give you that, that um, whole offering that you need to run your dealership as, as well as you can. So with that, Henry, I'm going to hand over to you. Thank you, Marlene. And uh, good morning, everyone. My name is Henry Pons. I'm currently in my 21st year with CDK. Uh, I have product management responsibility for heavy truck. And at some point in my career, I've had product responsibility for most of uh, core DMS. The DMS is essentially a, a productivity tool for you and your users and our mission centers around enhancing your productivity and operational efficiency. So a key to that goal is, is, is simplifying and streamlining workflows. The product teams responsible for, for drive applications are working to transform all drive workflows, starting with the most uh, used drive functionality that you depend on to run your business today. And I, I wanna stress that point because this is a key takeaway about what, uh, the investment in this effort uh, to, to transform the workflows uh, uh, to, to enhance productivity and operational efficiency. Now, achieving this uh, requires collaboration with you, including ongoing validation of what you, uh, what you need to accomplish with each workflow and then refining and simplifying the workflows to achieve those required results. Continuing with the understanding that the, the DMS is a productivity tool, one key goal is to help you get your employees uh, uh, who are new uh, in career to be productive quicker. And the example below in this slide uh, shows a legacy drive function on the left 
um, which most of you are familiar with, and then the transform workflow on the right. Now, my, my niece is starting uh, her sophomore year at the University of Oregon. And if I sit her down in front of the legacy function on the left, she would likely stare at it for, for a while uh, and then probably walk away <clears throat> not knowing where to start uh, or what the workflow was trying to accomplish. Certainly not familiar with the navigation. And, and she, would, she would need training uh, to be able to do that, uh, the workflow. But in this example, the, the transformed AP payments uh, workflow is intuitive, it's uh, streamlined, uh, it will guide the new in-career uh, employee uh, to complete the workflow and become productive sooner. With less hands-on training and also minimizing the opportunity for, for human error. For your experienced employees, uh, simplified workflows mean less time to complete and, and minimize, and again, minimize the, the opportunity for human error. Next slide, please. So these are examples of transformed workflows that, that, uh, uh, that have already been delivered as part of phase one. The reimagined 1099 workflow has a single screen approach, uh, making year end easier, uh, easy, fast, and uh, the new data model improves the overall accuracy. AP Payments workflow combines multiple functions uh, into fewer screens uh, that are easy to navigate uh, and again, enabling uh, the user to complete accurately. Uh, choice of payment methods, for example, checks and, and Chase virtual cards uh, are available now with additional uh, uh, payment uh, methods and, and processors that will be added over, over the coming year. A vendor management, uh, uh, another workflow that is easy to learn uh, and use um, with improved search and navigation. The company types and, and vendor categories are dealer defined. And the optional centralized vendor management feature is available for dealers who want to control uh, their vendor uh, information from a single uh, dash a a single uh, accounting account and it supports uh, what what many many of you have requested which, which is establishing a parent child relationships uh, across logons where um, and and DMS boxes where where the uh, changes that happen with the parent um, pass on to the child and the the the, 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 the child accounts are um, read only basically. Uh, below is a, co a quote from Laura Nelson at Metro Airport Truck. Um, uh, it's a nice, uh, nice feedback for the transform workflow. The new payment processing workflow has cut the time in half to run a, pay uh, a major payment run. So this, this is exactly the, the type of feedback we definitely want to get with the transform workflows uh, as we move forward. Next slide, please. <clears throat> Unify. Ideally, you've seen, you, you've already seen a uh, um, a demo for for CDK Unify, but for those who who have not seen it, a recording of the Unify demo will be made available. The objective with uh, Unify is to simplify the way that users access uh, CDK products, applications, and workflows. As CDK continues to deliver transform workflows, you will. Uh, your users will be able to launch these uh, workflows and the, the existing legacy uh, functions from one starting point, which will be uh, CDK Unify. The uh, users with access to other products, uh, as, as you saw earlier on in the session, I, I think uh, Mahesh covered it in, in one of the areas. Uh, if you, uh, for example, if your user has access to eLead, um, they will be able to access from one place. The idea is that you get to, to, to one place, unify, and, and you're able to access uh, the, um, the workflows and applications that you have uh, been granted access to as a user. The, I think a, a, another important uh, point here with unify, and uh, you know, it's certainly uh, administrators and, and all users that have had to deal with this is that um, Unify is browser agnostic. 
and drive transform workflows are browser agnostic, right? So you no CDK software or agent is loaded on a workstation to launch uh, unify or transform workflows. As your users adopt more and more of these workflows of the transform workflows, and and they will be delivered, you know, uh, um, you know every quarter uh, going forward. Uh, with uh, as I mentioned, with phase one already delivered, already um, available, um, the uh, you'll you will have more and more users who are able to complete their entire job. Right, the functions that they, the the functionality that they use today, with 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 new workflows, with the new transform workflows, uh, in an environment that'll they'll they'll be able to access them from CDK Unify. They'll be in an environment where they're browser agnostic. You could you, you'll be able to launch from Chrome, Safari, um, and and this will happen. The the transitional uh, to this is where we're headed. One last point uh, that I want to make about this, and I'll, I'll give this a plug because it, I think it's very important, is the, the foundational step uh, to Unify and to the workflows is the migration of users to IAM. CDK has an effort in progress to migrate all drive users to IAM simple ID by the end of this year. Once your users are migrated to IAM, they are eligible for, for Unify and 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 the transform workflows. Thank you for your time today. Uh, um, with that, I'll turn it. Uh, I'll turn it back to Dave Carson. Thank you. Uh, I know we covered a lot of information in a very short period of time, and we want to make sure that uh, this this information. Um, uh, hits the mark. So we're definitely we're going to be looking for some feedback. Um, but you know, one of the key things that I think a couple of key things that I think we really just want to get across is that uh, heavy truck is a very important part of CDK's core business. We are actively modernizing our solutions to help you run your businesses more efficient uh, efficiently. Um, we're introducing persona driven workflows to help your workers adapt to our uh, our solutions with more ease and uh, with a, a better navigation experience for them. We're bringing it all together, really, um, and I believe most of the people probably were uh, in the general session, perhaps. Um, we're bringing it all together uh, for you, our heavy truck dealers, the OEMs, the ISVs, and the customers. Uh, our goal is to give you, you know, the end-to-end -end opportunity to you know, run your business with most efficiencies, and as well as the best experiences. And we're just very grateful and thankful for your business and look forward to expanding our partnerships even further. So um, I wanted to say thank you. And again, I, I, I can't express enough how excited I am. My official first day as the VPGM for Heavy Truck is October 1st, but um, I, I haven't waded into the pool. I, I feel like I've jumped in already and I, I'm, I'm ready to get going. I hope you uh, enjoyed today's session and thank you everybody here for on camera for presenting and thank you all of you to listen in and, and spend part of your day with us. Thank you. Thank you everybody.